Welcome to this product video for Ravel Volume Measurement Kit with Digital Planimeter. In this kit, we have a digital pipette, three tips, three doctor blades, a microscope with a hundred times magnification capability, a bottle of testing liquid, a bottle of cleaning liquid, a pen, a planimeter, and a charger. First, you pick up the bottle of the testing liquid and then give it a good shake. After that, you can open it and set it aside. Then take the digital pipette and a tip. At first, the display is turned off, but when you insert the tip, the display will be turned on automatically. With this dial, you can adjust the amount of ink you apply. When you set it to 5, the display will tell you you can apply 10 microliters. Even when your battery is dead, you can still adjust the amount of ink with this dial. The bottom slide is used to fill the pipette. Start with sliding it all the way down and then insert it into the testing liquid. Then pull the slide all the way up to fill the pipette. After that, the display will be flashing. This means that the pipette is not yet calibrated. To fully calibrate it, you must insert the tip into the testing liquid again and this time push the top slide all the way down. Clean the outside of the tip so that there is no extra ink than the exact amount that you set the dial to. Now the pipette is fully calibrated. You are ready to measure. Use the top lever to apply the ink to an anilax roll. Slowly push it down into a horizontal line until it is empty. Then take a doctor blade from the kit and scrape the ink out on the roll as far as possible. Do this three times so that the ink is fully distributed. This is the normal 18 grams per square meter copy paper and you can use it to make an imprint of the ink. Place the paper on the roll like this and rub the paper over the area where the ink is. Doing this will leave a blot made by the 10 microliters of ink. Use the pen from the kit to mark the start and end point of the area you will measure using the planimeter. As you can see, the lens of the planimeter has a dot in the middle. Place this dot on the start point of the blot of ink and turn the planimeter on. The device will be set to square centimeters, but you change it to square inches using this button. For now, we will be using square centimeters. When you're ready, Push the start button and guide the dot on the lens all the way around the blot, back to the end point. Use your other hand to hold down the paper. After measuring the blot of ink, the planimeter tells us that the ink is distributed on an area of 37.3 square centimeters. Now you must always use the same formula to determine the volume of the Anilux roll. The amount of microliters of ink you apply to the roll times 10 divided by the surface of the blot that was measured by the planimeter in square meters. In this case, that is 10 times 10 divided by 37.3, which tells us that the volume of this anilux roll is 2.68 cubic meters per square meter.